Trooper Anna was a six-year veteran as a member of the New York State Police. She was a daughter, a fiancé, and the mother of a four-year-old son as well. I think right now it's, uh, it's quite a shock to her family and those who work with, closely with her in the uh, Hastings Barracks. So right now we're going to try to get them um, the, all the support that they need. It was a difficult day for anyone in a police uniform locally in Hastings where Trooper Anna worked every day and throughout the whole state. Like anything else, these barracks and these stations throughout you know, central New York uh, a very close-knit group. And uh, certainly um, it's, it's more of a family atmosphere. And um, it's, it's extremely uh, tough this morning and, uh, and emotional. With her family in mind, she took the reins every day as a New York State Trooper, which isn't always easy. We put the uniform on, there's, uh, there's some expectance of, of, of a risk. But when uh, we arrive to a, a scene such as this, it's, uh, it's even harder when we, it's one of our own. Trooper Keller says they are in the process of planning a memorial for Anna and her family and we'll do so with Trooper Anna's spirit in mind. Work through and, and try to provide the best service we can for Amanda and, uh, and really celebrate her life in, in a true way and the true hero that she was. A hero that will be remembered for her ultimate sacrifice. Tom Eschen reporting.